Well, hello, welcome to our weekly team training that we like to call the weekly high five. This is Don Thompson and today I'm gonna to talk to you about a leadership topic that is near and dear to my heart because I love to talk about leadership. To me, uh, when you talk about the success of an organization, everything rises and falls on leadership like John C. Maxwell likes to talk about in all of his great leadership books. But one of the concepts that I've really attached myself to is the concept of the thermometer and the thermostat, which is why I'm standing right next to a thermometer and a thermostat. Now, first of all, don't worry about me. I'm not standing in a room that's 91 degrees. I think the thermometer is broken, but I wanted you to really have a visual for the difference between a thermometer and a thermostat because it's important that you understand this principle when you're leading your organization. You know, what does a thermometer do? A thermometer just tells you what the outside temperature is. It just takes a survey of the environment around us and it just tells us that this is the temperature of the room right now. There's not a whole lot I can do right now that's gonna change this because it's just telling me what my environment is. However, what does a thermostat do? A thermostat sets the environment. A thermostat sets the temperature. And that's the kind of leader that we need to be to be effective in our legal shield organization. We need to set the temperature for, for our organization. If I push this button right here, the temperature is going to go up. And if I lower it, the temperature is going to go down. In other words, I determine what the temperature of my organization is. You know, so many times I've talked to leaders in the past and I've asked them, you know, are you going to hit performance club this month? Are you going to go senior director this month? Are you going to hit executive director this month? And they'll come back with answers like, well, let me talk to a few leaders on my team, see what their plans are. Let me talk to a few other people. I've got a couple groups I got to check in with to see if I'm going to be able to get in there this month for enrollments and things like that. And then I'll get back to you based on those answers. And they don't always say based on those answers, but that's really what they're saying. I'll get back to you and let you know what my goals are for this month. In other words, they're leading like a thermometer. They're just taking a survey of the land around them, taking a survey of everyone else around them, and then based on that, just telling you what is the temperature of my organization right now. The temperature of my organization is, yes, I can go executive director this month. Or the temperature of my organization is, no, this is not gonna be the right month to go executive director. But what does a thermostat do? A thermostat determines what the temperature is going to be. If you're gonna go executive director this month, you set that temperature to executive director and that's where you're going to go. Now, you may not even know how you're going to get there, but by setting the temperature, you put the, the uh, you know, really universe in motion to help you get to the goals that you've set out for yourself. In other words, you've determined ahead of time, before you've talked to anyone else, before you've taken the temperature, you've determined that you're gonna be an executive director this month. Then you reach out to the leaders around you and you find out who's with you. Hey, this is the temperature I'm going. I'm going executive director this month. I wanna know who's with me, who's going senior director. Who's leveling up to senior associate? Who's leveling up to manager? You know, how many associates can we bring on the team to help us do that? You set the goal first, and then you put everything in motion to decide how you're going to do that. What's the game plan to get you to that temperature that you've set for yourself? You know, the same concept works at every level. It doesn't matter if you're going for manager, if you're going for senior manager, if you're going for senior director, whatever the level is that you're setting out for yourself to achieve this month, you have to be the thermostat that sets the temperature for your organization. You determine where you're going to be this month. You don't let other people determine for you. Now, the key to being a great thermostat leader is that once you set the temperature, you've got to cast the vision of how you and your team together collectively is going to reach that temperature. You know, you've got to be out front. You've got to lead by example. You've got to be at the business briefings. You've got to be at the Super Saturdays. You need to be plugged into our team training calls. You need to be on our Zoom presentations and have guests on there to take a look at the opportunity. You know, many times as a leader, you'll set out and you'll say, this is the direction I'm going. This is the temperature I'm setting. And really, there's nobody following you. There's nobody with you on your team. So you have two choices at that point. You can either readjust your temperature or you can say, you know what? I'm gonna keep my temperature right where it's at, but I'm gonna make it my determination. It's up to me. It's not up to anybody else whether I hit this or not. I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna sponsor enough new people to help me hit that level. That's what a thermostat leader does. They don't let other people determine their success. They set out, they know what their goals are, and they're gonna achieve those goals with or without other people in the organization. I've often said, and I, I always say this in a, in a loving way, but if every single person on my team quit, 
I would be right back to this level in a few short months. And the reason why is because I'm going to set the temperature for my organization with this thermostat right here. I'm going to set it. I'm not going to let anyone else determine the success for me and my family. And I would say the same thing to you. Don't let anyone else on your team determine your success. Don't let anyone else on your team tell you what the temperature around you in the environment says. You set the temperature for your organization. You be a thermostat leader. You lead by example. You lead out front. And you're going to see massive results in your legal shield business.